Uh, well, my name's Ivor Lewis. Um, I am going to be ordained uh, as a deacon at, at the parish of St John and St Peter uh, in Ladywood. Well, firstly, I'm from Birmingham. I'm actually, um, we actually grew up not far from Ladywood. Um, we grew up in, in Lee Bank. Uh, part of my sort of time as a, um, uh, as a kind of youth worker working for a church in Aston uh, meant that I spent a lot of time around kind of clergy people. I can't pretend that this lightning bolt kind of came from, from heaven and, uh, and that kind of caused me to go, right, I must, I must get involved in this kind of clergy thing because um, that didn't happen. But what did happen was um, that kind of along the way, uh, people kind of were just kind of giving me a bit of a nudge. Kind of, have you thought about that? Have you thought about that? And it wasn't until I went to a kind of a youth work conference, and I don't know if it was jet lag or what, but I kind of just felt like kind of God had got my attention, and um, and there was a real sense of God kind of saying that I want you to take this leadership thing seriously. And it wasn't that I hadn't, it wasn't that I wasn't taking it seriously because I was involved as a member of the staff team, as part of the, 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 uh, the local parish church. Um, but it did make me think about this and, and it was kind of one of those kind of benchmark kind of situations that as I look back I kind of think, okay, right, things were beginning to fall into place. One of, the, one of the difficulties about um, kind of leadership and church leadership was something where the, where the person that you see um, at the front, um, if they look like you, then you can kind of assume that what they do is accessible to you. If they come from the same kind of background, it's the same kind of thing. Um, and as I kind of look at my, uh, at my kind of history, I kind of go, well, actually, why would God call someone like me? I'm not particularly educated. I'm not particularly um, anything, you know, outside of ordinary. So why would God call someone like me? And yet He does. Thank you.